Hey there, I am to bring you Naruto chapter 624, uh, Aiko I think it's called, and well, uh, it wasn't too bad, I mean it's always good to see past moving forward quickly, but it also felt it was skipping some very important parts, I don't know which, well uh, technically I do, but I'll, I'll first spoil the plot by saying this. Well, uh, the parents and the youngest brother fight, uh, the family fight, and when the fathers try to take out the Uchiha, their their en enemies of their sons, uh, then uh, Madara and Hashirima intervenes, and after that Madara changes. His curse of hatred awakens, and he says that he loathes now Hashirima and said that that uh, his name is Uchiha Madara and his manga and his Sharingan activates or or maybe it already was activated no idea either way it's uh, its power is now here and after that they say the and that instead of focusing on little things they instead fast forward to that uh, Madara and Hashirima's countless battles all their time apparently Madara lost and on one fight, Tobrama fatally wounded Isana, who was Madara's beloved brother. And then, when they retreated from that one, apparently Isana died from a wound from there. And uh, after that, ha Madara changed even more, and he awakened his Susano. But then, after one battle, Madara was on his knees, or on his back. But instead of killing him, Hashirima once again said, Please, Madara, can't we just fulfill that dream? Because even though Ma Hashirima grew up, he always believed in that dream, he was saying as a kid. However, Madara only says, Kill yourself or, my, or your brother, then we're even. Madara, you really are a hateful person, huh? Unlike many villains, I have not of yet felt any sympathy towards Madara. Or have I? No, I don't think I have. I mean, Madara is just a being of pure evil. Uh, so he's also a big of a loser. I mean, I mean, it, his hatred in this was was the theme of this chapter, and it came so quickly. It almost felt ridiculously quickly. The reason for his beginning of his hate was when the when Butsama Senju, Hashima's father, tried to kill Isana, uh, Madara intervened and that awakened his hatred because he said that he won't forgive anybody who attacks his brother. But, uh, and, uh, and on that fight, when Tuberama gave Isana a fatal wound, was apparently the, the fight where he awakened his, his Mangeko Cheringen or no, or his Susano. Apparently to Tobi, he, Madara got blind from using the Eternal Mangiko and then stole Isana's or took Isana's eyes. So, but this wasn't in this chapter, so I guess my guess is this. The fatal wound was killing Isana, so he gave up his eyes to his brother because he knew he was going to die. So, and he knew that his brother was going to go blind. So, he said, so since Asana was dying, he gave his eyes to his brother so he could live on. Maybe, maybe that's the true history of the eternal Mangeko Shiringen of Madara. But of course, that is not explained. Mm. And, but, uh, well, his hatred is so deep in that part. It's a bit fascinating that Hashirima still considers him a friend. I guess that really proves Hashirima is a good person. Nothing really new to say except all except that Sharingan mystery I told you earlier. It's uh, nothing new. It was good to see them fast forwarding a bit. I mean, I had a feeling this was going to take a long time, but it wasn't too bad. It could have been better, but it wasn't too bad. I'll see you next time. Bye.